Uh, not necessarily through the eyes of uh, the, uh, the the the, the uh, attendees, but more or less through the eyes uh, of uh, the people who put on them. In other words, these are marketing uh, videos. These are videos uh, designed to sort of bring in and show people a, a, a little taste of IMAX. Uh, but as it, I had chosen eyes, uh, well, five different eyes to see for me. There was, uh, as I did my search around uh, YouTube to see uh, who had actually gone to IMAX New York, uh, I found five people had, that I had uh, interesting videos from, and I will tell you who they are. Now, I say it that uh, when you do virtual traveling, you're traveling through the eyes of another person. So I chose, and as I did a search around the internet, I found about five people uh, that I thought had good videos and really gave me a sense of, yeah, I was there, and was, you know, at New York, I was there for IMAX. Gave me a good sense for what was actually going on. Uh, I could have gone further into depth, but there just wasn't enough time. There's so much actually going on here that I'm trying now that I'm trying to launch uh, the TV channels here, so it wasn't actually the time to do that, and so I had to uh, sort of uh, uh, pare down who I actually uh, went to. The first person that uh, had a lot of videos up there, she had a, 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 a fair amount of time at, at IMAX. Her name is Christine, or should I say Christy, and she's uh, Strawberry Electric, or more Christy. Christy. Uh, her beauty channel is uh, Strawberry Electric 48, and then her vlog channel is More Christy. And I spent, she actually had a normal amount of time, well, not a normal amount, a good amount of time. She had about a half hour worth of material that she could go through and sort of see what was what as uh, you were going, as she was going through IMAX. She, take, she takes you from the airport all the way through her adventure. Uh, then there was uh, Lindsay. Lindsay uh, was, is, or should I say, is. Uh, Beauty Baby 44, and then Living Like Lindsay is her vlog. Uh, the other one is uh, Brittany from uh, Ms. MS Brittany uh, Bratt. Uh, that's her channel there. Her channel is MS Brittany Bratt, and Brittany is spelled B R I T T A N Y. So you can go check her channel. All the information is going to be in the down below bar for this. And then uh, the fourth one is uh, Danielle and they uh, uh, the, the vlog uh, the vlogs by Danielle that's her channel the vlogs by Danielle uh, and that's all one word there's no spaces in between there's no underscores all one word so if you want to check out her channel and then the uh, last one I went to uh, sort of added in filled in things was uh, Mandy and that's uh, a, a it's, it's a little it's a little complex because her channel is Mandy, but she puts in a lot of different levels as well. But it's going to be in the down below bar. If you want to check out her channel, you go ahead and do that, uh, and you'll find a lot of good stuff there. So from the eye map, from from the uh, different eyes that we had, from the different eyes we have, the five different eyes, what do we get? We end up starting off traveling to New York. And most of the videos showed you uh, either leaving uh, on the plane or arriving at the airport in the at New York. Uh, then from there, they take a taxi ride and go to have something to eat, and then eventually they get to the hotel room where they meet. Uh, so they have the a hallway full of friends. Matter of fact, I think uh, most of them when they got there were staying with friends, and you had this interaction with all these beauty gurus uh, in the hotel room. In other words, in addition to having the, the partying going on, the, the fun going on at IMAX itself, the trade show itself, there was a lot of fun in the hotel room that you could sort of could sort of see uh, as uh, the various different people were vlogging. Now, I could have gone more in depth into this, uh, looked, at, looked for more vlogs, but I wasn't able to do so. I think I'm going to do this for the next IMAX, the next uh, major trip that they have uh, out there uh, that for, for the beauty community, if there is one. And I'll try to see if I can find something, you know, get more details and, and do a more in-depth 
uh, review of this in terms of a virtual travel, but uh, it, what I saw was good for me. It was, it was it, you know, I really liked it. I got to see the hotel room. I got to see their, the friends that they were there. Uh, then you could see the restaurants that they went to. Uh, there were a lot of restaurants that they went to, tried out different things. Uh, and you could see invariably that for some of the girls, the thing was Starbucks and a Caesar salad. So you have a big cup of coffee or whatever drink they had and a Caesar salad. These were the sort of the quintessential things that they sort of, uh, or the standard things that you actually, that you kind of had to have with you. Uh, but that was with some of the group, with some of the girls. Other girls had other different things. Uh, also, they also went the uh, food. They went uh, shopping for clothes. They all shopped there. Apparently, a lot of people do a lot of shopping there. A lot, you know. One of the main things there is shopping because in the exhibit, so you can go out to the different booths and you can buy things at different booths. So, yay! That was that. I think that would have been a cool thing. But there are no all from trade shows. There's certainly a lot of swag. Uh, these different booths, in addition to selling things, give things away. So, um, I was able to see some of those things, like like wig and you know other other different types of uh, makeup items were there as well. Uh, then there was IMAX itself. That was, that was IMAX itself. It was, it was in the, the, the exhibition floor, and from what I saw, that they ended up not only meeting people in the hotel room, but they also met people on the floor of IMAX. They met fans who uh, were fans of their channels, uh, their YouTube channels. Uh, they met their fans at IMAX, but they all didn't meet them just simply at IMAX. There was a sort of a separate meetup uh, that they had done in New York. And I think these meetups are now becoming more and more common where uh, fans and other uh, YouTubers can sort of get together and uh, all hang out with each other. It's sort of uh, takes, it's a takeoff of these uh, nerd, nerd fighter gatherings. Uh, this is sort of a, a, a beauty guru or a, a YouTube type of thing now where you have one from the nerd fighter gatherings to a uh, YouTube meeting or meetups. And we got to see that as well. Then there are the parties uh, done by the different uh, channel sponsors like Style Hall and uh, I think there's, another, there's a couple more, but I can't remember what they are. Uh, I didn't really write them down. My notes were a little, uh, a little uh, off today uh, for this episode. But anyways, I think you know from what I saw and from the when and when they saw everyone leaving, leaving the uh, hotel rooms and saying goodbye to each other and eventually going off in the different directions. Uh, back to YouTube again, and in one other words, you see them again after I'm at New York, you see them again on their vlog, regular vlogs, in their, in their regular rooms, in their regular environment where they normally film, and things, you know, slowly start getting to get back to normal again. But it, it, was, it, it was a fun way of traveling, uh, because I don't really get out and travel that much in terms of long distance. Uh, this was some way of, uh, uh, it was, this was something for me to sort of Take a few minutes out of my day, uh, see something a little different than I don't that I normally see. So I had a good time. Uh, uh, hopefully, maybe we can do this in a, in a better format, maybe a more uh, interactive video uh, rather than just me, simply me talking. So we'll see what happens as the uh, show develops, as Beauty Geek develops. We're now moving on to episode number four coming up. Uh, hopefully, we get back to our normal shooting schedule. That means every Tuesday and every Friday. There should be a, an episode of Beauty, Beauty and the Geek popping up. Anyways, see you on Tuesday for Beauty and the Geek, the next episode of Beauty and the Geek. Alright, take it easy. Goodbye. Democratic Earth. Earth.